TC Graphic. Exploring Creativity Daily. Hi, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so today uh, we'll be talking something that's very, very important in graphic design, especially for smartphone graphic designers. So it's about printing. How do you arrange your design for printing? How do you convert it from RGB to CMYK? All right. And again, we'll be looking at um, size dimensions. All right. So you discover that your um, Pixel Lab uses um the size the size it uses is in pixel which is the uh, lowest uh, measurement okay so and you discover that some of your clients might say okay, i need eight by ten meaning eight feet by ten feet so how do you do it so if you come to pixel lab i just type eight by so eight by ten then that's not it because your pixel lab uh measurement is in pixels so how do you convert this so that's what this video is all about we're going to talk about that measurement dimension and how to convert your rgb because every design you do here your pixel lab is in R so we're going to look at how to convert from rgb towards cmyk all right before you go ahead and print because your printing machine doesn't recognize the rgb color all right so before we get to the tutorial button and like this video thank you so much anytime you do that it gives me the courage to keep on giving you more videos because it tells me that people are really watching and they want more all right thank you so um let's talk about the sizes now so first thing i'm going to do is to okay before that um this is um where you change the size of your canvas okay now you now come to your chrome sorry come to your chrome browser and um, it's not necessary any any browser features you now type um um uh, feet feet sorry feet to pixel just type it like this as simple as that as it is so um then click on this one justintools.com allow it to load so um you can see um it has come up so this is site you'll be using so you come here so you can see uh one feet is a pixel so you can just use your calculator knowing this constant the, con uh, the conversion or you can just come here to type so you want to convert the eight feet now you type eight feet and uh, you click on convert you allow it to come up so um, this becomes your eight feet now uh, 8 feet is equivalent to 916 pixels. You can forget the decimal points, just copy this. All right, so we now come here and type 10, convert, click on convert, and you allow it to come up. Okay, so you can see the 10 feet here. Okay, like I told us, you can just use your calculator to do it having known the constant that one feet is equal to 1522 i think so um i showed you here earlier so you know that so copy it you now come to your pixel lab so um next you have to um know is to know if it is portrait or um landscape okay if it is landscape then you know that this one will be here Okay, let's just do it like this so you see what i mean this one is portrait if this is portrait so this is 8 by 10 portrait format okay you can see how it's looking but if it is landscape all right so this one will be here so the height the height will be here the height will be the width sorry so why this one will be like this so all right you now have it like this this is the landscape so even if they are giving you 15 by 20 or 18 by 25 just do it so after conversion you discover that when you put it your canvas here might look so small don't be deceived by that just go ahead and do your design but when you print it you discover that it's a very big um size okay all right so let's um head over to the second one which is the conversion of RGB 
to cmyk okay so um first of all go to your chrome browser or any other browser you're using at all okay so you come here and you click rgb type rather rgb to cmyk image converter so it's still here so all right click this first one so it will come up like this you can see choose a file so upload a design that you want to click there upload your design that you want to convert to cmyk all right so i've told us why you need to convert to cmyk because your the printing machine doesn't recognize so let me use this one i think that's what i've done for so once it comes up so you come to this place change this one to jpeg normally it's supposed to be in this tiff but because if i use this one here i will not be able to view it in this phone so i'm going to choose jpeg so that you see the result so um after choosing this you're going to click start all right leave the other options the way it is you don't need to change anything there and allow it to um, load and give you results so wait for it while it comes up so you can see before and after wow so you can see the difference the difference is so clear so with this you have a clear how your prints um how it's going to look like when you print your work all right so this is how it is okay so um is this other one you are going to send to your um printer or whoever that wants to print it um printing press rather send it to printing press and they'll print it okay so if you want to download it now just touch the image and it will download so i don't want to download it again you can set the size so i've downloaded it so i'll just go ahead and show you the downloaded version of it and the one i downloaded so you can see the way it's looking now it doesn't really look, look so nice compared to the original design all right so uh but there's one thing i want us to know in case if you are doing this for some client that are so stubborn uh you don't want to use this kind of thing and make them not to uh like your work but it's still fine yeah it's still fine actually but the color of the other one is still much more better so if you're working with such clients that prove stubborn you just send the normal one that the person will like or you send the two tell the person that well, if you want to print it see the one you have to send okay so that it doesn't alter your work okay you can see it. so let me now show the rgb color and that of so you can see the original design can you see the difference you see how this one is so fine okay so boss what what you um once you convert it you discover um it has changed so that's the color it picked is what the printer is going to um is to give you out so that's the end of this tutorial and i'll see you next time so uh, don't forget to subscribe and like this video thank you bye